Well, from cupcakes to croissants, this vegan bakery is probably going to make your mouth water. Lori Wallace mm -hmm. live with a look at Mud Pie Stand's new brick and mortar. <laughs> I am so excited about this. Yeah. Mm. All right, Court, I get it. You're vegan, and this this really is for you. But Hulisa and I don't discriminate against That's dessert. That's right. So we're That's right in right. that same category <laughs> with you. So we're all going to get excited about it together. And Hulisa, you'll remember them because yes. you did a segment about a year ago when they were working out of this bus. Yeah, and on their driveway. And they have grown oh. immensely through COVID. Yes, right at their home in their driveway. They were so busy, and now they have their own brick and mortar here downtown. So I have Dina with me to talk a little bit about that transfer information so exciting yes hi thank you so uh, we basically were doing home pickups out of our bus in the back of the bus and uh, essentially we're doing it from Thursday through Saturday and we just got so busy that our whole house was taken over and so we reached out to the community and just said you know look we really want to expand this uh, we needed some help so we did crowdfunding and we were able to successfully raise money to help us open this space so we think of ourselves as a very community driven bakery and we're 100% vegan and we are just so excited to Yummy. be here to serve our community. Yeah, they were going to either have to move out of their house or get a brick and mortar. So they went this route. Um, okay, I'm going to let Scott lead the way here. Um, and that's Sal back there. We're not going to make Sal do too much talking, but Sal is making croissants. So that's the good news. And you guys do a really special, uh, unique product here. And you guys have worked really hard to perfect. So talk a little bit about what Scott's looking at there. Yeah, so we um, we do a bunch of cupcakes, as you can see here. So we have, those are strawberry top, strawberry vanilla, and strawberry lemon. Also a raspberry vanilla. So everything we do Yellow. as far as flavor goes is we layer on those flavors. So if you're getting strawberry, you're getting a full flavored strawberry flavor. Um, and we just want to make sure that everything just tastes amazing. It doesn't matter that it's vegan, it just tastes amazing. And that's our focal point. Um, and then what Sal is doing, we're, we pride ourselves on very, very much so, which is hand laminating croissants. Um, oh, and various pastries from it that? using Miyoko's butter, which we think is the best butter to use for this. Um, and we're able to get really nice layers and very traditional flavors that people are familiar with. Yeah, and what yeah. you said about being vegan, it's like you. a lot of people hear vegan and think, oh yeah, I'm not vegan, right. I'm good. Right. Oh, no, 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 you should try this because <laughs> that really is secondary to what you guys do here. It, absolutely. Um, we are both traditionally trained in the restaurant industry. And uh, really, we just want to make food amazing for everybody. And we're vegans ourselves, and so we want to bring that to our community and make sure that they're uh, also enjoying amazing stuff. Okay, let's talk about this space here because now you're able to welcome people inside when you open. You have that great little patio space. So, kind of, what does the future look like for for your space here? Yeah. Um, so this week we're starting soft hours for the bakery. So we'll be starting tomorrow through Friday, 10 to 3. Um, that's just as we wait for our espresso machine. Then we will be opening it at 8 a.m. And then this weekend we will be starting to open, full, moving forward also with our cafe. So we will be offering savory breakfast items as well as savory lunch specials. And that will be from 10 to 3 on the weekends as well. Okay, it must feel so good to have your house back. Oh my gosh, yes. <laughs> it's still kind of a mess, but we're getting there. <laughs> you are getting there. And now you can get here and get all these delicious vegan desserts, you guys. Everything looks so great. Um, um, again, they're looking to expand a little bit with hours and everything as time moves on. You can find them on Instagram, and we're going to link all of their information to our website as well. Mud Pie Stan. Love the name, too. Right? Back so to cute. I, I will say, Lori, mm -hmm. because, you know, I'm all about making sure, you know, quality control. I did... <laughs> taste one of their pies last time I did a segment mm -hmm. and I can vouch for the amazingly delicious mm. treats that mm -hmm. they make. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I <laughs>